In today's video, we're going to learn how to sign an APK and upload it to the Play Store. Open Google Play Console and create an account if you don't already have one. Click on Create Application and type the title of your application. As you can see on the left hand side, there are four options with exclamation points next to them. Basically, these are the four fields that we'll be completing right now. We are currently on Store Listing. Fill in the short description and the full description of your application. Remember, these descriptions will be visible to any user who visits your app on the Play Store. Now, you need screenshots of your application. Google Device Art Generator and click on the first link that pops up. Drag the screenshot that is present on your local computer and drop it on the device of your choice. Right click and save these images on your computer. Do this for all the screenshots that you want to appear on the Play Store. Click on Browse Files and select all these images that you've just created. For your application icon, go to any online resizing tool and change the resolution of the icon to 512 by 512 pixels. Google Android Feature Graphic Generator and generate the feature graphic that is required. I'm just gonna have a black background and display my icon in the middle. You can mess around and create the feature graphic of your own choice. Upload the icon and the feature graphic that you have just created. Choose if your application is a normal application or a game. Select one of the categories out of the many categories available. You can add a website if you have one and the privacy policy, although these, these are not necessary. After you click save draft, as you can see, there's a tick next to store listing instead of an exclamation point. When you go to content rating, it tells you to upload an APK before continuing. Go to app releases and go to production. If you want to release an alpha or a beta version of your application, then you can upload the APK in the respective category. Add the name of your application again and add what is new in your application in the given text box. Now before uploading your APK, you need to make sure it's signed. Let's do that. Click on build and click on generate signed APK. If you already have a key store, you can go ahead and add, it, add the path. But then I don't, so I'm going to create a new one. Here, Keystore Path refers to the path where you want the Keystore to be saved after it's created. Create a password and make sure you note it down. For the key, give it any name you want and give it another password. Give your first and last name and the other details required. Click on OK. Now you can give the path of the key store that you just created over here. Give the name of the key and the password that you just typed in. Check in both the text boxes next to signature version and click on finish. This will generate your signed APK. Now, click on Locate. Go to App and click on Release. That's where the signed APK will be stored. Drag and drop it in the Play Console. After it's done uploading, click on save and now you can see a tick next to app releases. Go to content rating and click on continue. 
enter your email address over here. After doing that, select the type of your application. Now, you will be asked a set of standard questions that you have to answer based on your application. Make sure you answer these truthfully. Click on save questionnaire and calculate rating after you're done. You can apply rating too. Move on to the next part, pricing and distribution. Select if your application is a paid or a free one. Again, you have a couple of questions that you need to answer. Make sure you accept both the guidelines and the US export laws. Select the countries that you want the application to be released in. In my case, I want everything, so I'm just going to click the available radio button on top. Click on save draft and you have all four ticks on the left hand side. Go to app releases, click on edit release and click on review. Click on start rollout to production and there you are. Your application should be on the play store in two to four hours. Confirm and there you are. Uh, your status should be pending publication as you can see on the dashboard. Do like and subscribe for more on point videos just like this one.